The mural in the house chamber depicts a meeting near the town of Shampooey on May 2, 1843. Shampooey is now a historic state park along the Willamette River in Marion County. It was at this meeting that attendees voted by a margin of 52 to 50 to set up a provisional government and agreed on some boundaries for the territory. During the meeting at Shampooey, a mountain man by the name of Joe Meek was instrumental in persuading his fellow Oregonians that they should vote to set up a provisional government and then wait for the U.S. to take ownership of the region. Meek would later become the first Oregon U.S. Marshal. Etienne Lucier was one of two French-Canadian fur trappers who voted for the provisional government. He is pictured shaking hands with the gentleman in white. William H. Gray, Judge Babcock, William Wilson, and George Labreton were the officers at this meeting. They are pictured on the platform at the bottom of the mural. The mural was painted by the artist Barry Faulkner in 1938, during the construction of the current capital. Mr. Faulkner's reputation as an artist was built on the murals he painted. You can also see two more of his murals in the rotunda and on either side of the marble steps leading up to the house chamber. The meeting at Shampooey is an important part of Oregon history. It paved the way for statehood in 1859 and helped to establish the northern U.S. border with Canada.